Hi, this is Saev Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome everybody, uh, guys. As usual, we will take a look uh, at the gold market. Well, on the gold market, situation mostly the same as on the uh, euro currency because we approximately know the bit larger barriers to the upside to the downside. So, to the downside on the gold market is the 13 even area, to the upside is the 1360 area. But market still can't create the pattern some inside of this range to choose the direction. So market right now mostly stands in decision. Uh, as we close uh, coming to December, to the first rate increase to the end of the financial year, we mostly have spoken about it yesterday, then the nervousness of the market will increase and uh, traders will stronger react on any volatility that could appear on the market. So for example, this drop uh, already could make traders think that maybe it's time to take the profit and the close the financial year because it's just a month still to the end of the year. It's very significant uh, appreciation of the gold market in the current year. So just uh, close the position and see what will happen or take the most large part amount of the uh, profit and close the position and keep just the minor uh, trading volume. So and as we, as we close we will come to December uh, the stronger these thoughts will be. So right now we see that the recent drop on the gold market mostly uh, looks uh, bearish because market has dropped below the monthly pivot point. It has uh, broken the consolidation here to the downside. It means that the short term direction has been chosen to the downside because take a look. These three candles indicates indecision. Small candles with long tails. This market just uh, trying to understand what is going on and the direction was to the downside, was chosen. Also market hasn't quite reached the upper border of this consolidation. Uh, formally, we see that trend is bullish, but the action is not really very good for taking the long position. What we could do currently on the gold market? I think the two thoughts, uh, uh, two moments that we could uh, make. First of all, we could wait what will happen here. If market will, for, will form the bullish grabber, this will be the bullish pattern. Um, in this case, maybe it will be something that we could use to speak about the long position here, or that market could show the upward action. This is the first moment that we have on the daily chart. Uh, so uh, that being said, this gold market should keep the bullish trend, and it will be preferable if market will form the bullish grabber here. On the intraday charts, guys, uh, what really could happen? For example. Uh, as you can see, market stands right now at the 1320 support area that we have suggested yesterday. This market has broken through the weekly period point. Uh, this was also the first FIB level. We said that probably it will come to the next level since sell off was really fast. And that was a uh, 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 correct suggestion. You can see market dropped right to the 618 support. The next support area stands slightly below the market, it's approximately 1350 area. And this is weekly period support one. And take a look, the 618 target of this A. B, C top, D passion. So, for example, if market will test the weekly pivot support one and move higher out, uh, out from it, complete this minor target, um, this will tell to th uh, tell us uh, two, two things. First of all, we will get the grabber here, and second, market will be held by the weekly pivot support one. It will tell us that this probably could be treated as a retracement since the market was able to hold above the weekly period support one. If this will not happen, the market drops lower, will drop below it. This will tell us that's not the time to take the long position, guys, on the gold market. On the hourly chart, this action could take the shape of some kind of the butterfly, guys, I think. So because the 127 extension of the most recent swing up stands precisely at 1350 area. 1350, 1316, that stands in agreement with the weekly period support one and the 618 target. So that's been said. 
we need to see that market stands above the major supports and keep bullish trend on the daily chart this will be preferable if market will form the grabber in this case we at least somehow could think about the tactical long position or something of that sort based on the patience that we will get if nothing of this will, uh, will happen this market will just drop below the support area so it tells us that's not the time uh, to take the long position so that's our current view on the gold market